Hey guys, it's Brandon, and I'm back at it again, this time with a follow-up to my brand review. I told you that if the three-decker pomade company decided to update Dapper Boy, which they did, that I'd be interested in doing a review of it. So that's what this is. This is kind of a follow-up. If you haven't watched the brand overview, a brief summary of the Dapper Boy was that I thought it was a good product. I liked the scent. I liked the way that it applied. I liked pretty much everything about it. My biggest concern is that it said it was a firm hold with medium shine, and I felt like it was a like medium at most. You could really pile it on and get a firm out of it, but like a very light firm. So to me, I felt like this was kind of a work in progress. Um, however, they updated the formula and same ingredients and everything, um, but they put it in a plastic jar so it's easier for them to ship overseas. And I feel like personally, when you look at this, I was like, oh look, the dog has tattoos, it's cute. But I feel like the label with the, the black label as compared to this one, um, I feel like this pops a little bit better. So that's the first thing. Secondly, I already have some product in my hair, but secondly, I'm just going to tell you that the scent is the same. The scoopability, which and if you're just watching this for the review, the scent is kind of like a, a sandalwood, sweet type vanilla scent. Really nice. Really, really pleasant. The scoop on this is still really easy. It kind of scoops out. Um, I feel like a tiny bit thicker than the last stuff, but not that bad, but it still breaks all the way down like lotion. Now with this stuff, it goes away instantaneously. Instantly when you're putting this stuff in your hair, as compared to the last stuff, to the first iteration, so to speak, if you don't have your hair damp, you're going to immediately feel as compared to the first, you're going to me, you're going to immediately feel some tugging and pulling. This is in fact firmer <laughs> than the last product. And that's one thing that we all asked for. We were all really super wanting is something that was a lot firmer. Everybody that has reviewed it, that I've seen so far, talked about it, complained that as a whole, it came off more like a medium which isn't necessarily a bad thing. I personally think they could take the old formula, lighten it up a very touch, and turn it into an actual medium unorthodox water base, and they would be personally fine. One thing you can do, like I've said in my past reviews, is you can wet your hair down. I kind of stepped off screen to put a little bit of water in my hair to make this a little bit more of a uh, more pleasant application experience. And that's the thing. With most products that are dry-ish, or feel firmer in the hair like this just put it in damp hair sometimes even almost wet hair and you have a better experience um, so anyways combing it back felt thick felt nice in comparison to the other iteration definitely feels like there's something in your hair definitely feels firmer and when you're styling for effing sure you can tell there's a big difference I feel like this is solid especially when I put water in it, that it's just like it's stuck in place. So for me, I am really, really happy with the change they did to this. The current iteration of this stuff uh, is exactly what I wanted. It's nice and firm, actually so much so that it almost takes two and it almost takes two washes to wash this out completely because the stuff does stay pretty thick in your hair if you layer it on because when I started I, I was layering it because I was like oh this might be light again boy was I wrong so anyways you can see I got a nice little shine going on right there and so for me styling feels a lot easier although it wasn't hard in the first place but styling was pretty easy this time around because I like the type of stuff that feels like you have something thick in your hair. So it doesn't feel like heavy, but when you run your comb through it, you definitely feel like you got a product in your hair. So keeping this short and sweet, what do I think about this? Well, the difference is, is that clearly the hold has been like, without a doubt, up to a firm. It's a lot better. Um, but because of that, because of the firmness change, it's a little bit, you know, less comfortable to apply to your hair. That can be remedied with obviously putting water in your hair and just uh, doing it damp. Also, the endurance is a lot better. I felt like the old stuff used to taper off kind of halfway or to the beginning of the day. This stuff starts to taper off hold-wise towards the end of the day. So I can keep a bulbous, girthy pomp for the majority of the day and not worry about restyling. Restyle-wise, 
it's fine. Like it's, you just put a little bit of water in there and it'll reactivate it, it works good. So overall, um, in comparison to, whoops, I got a little, <laughs> I always do that. So in comparison to the old version, uh, leaps and bounds above this. Uh, rating it on its own, I would have to give this a 4.5 out of 5. This is an excellent product. I think that this is right where it needs to be. I think the change that they did in hold and kind of everything that they did to it, um, just in general, adding the firmness, upping the endurance, all of this stuff by changing it up. This is exactly where it needs to be. This is a good uh, firm on orthodox water base and I feel like it can hold its own with most of the other ones on the market. Um, it does what most people want. It breaks down like lotion. It applies easy in damp hair and it styles really easy. You can even use a blow dryer if you want to, but I prefer, because I like a little bit of shine, because this does say medium shine, I like leaving my hair wet, walking out in the morning with the style in like this and letting it dry naturally. So overall, yeah, um, follow up from my brand overview, definitely can recommend this, especially the new iteration and definitely can say this is where it needs to be now and it gets my approval. If you have any other questions, leave them in the comment section below. Let me know if you've tried this or the old iteration and um, have a good one.